the same thing and if you want of them i hope to Welcome back to my channel. This is your girl, the Lamia Day. How are you guys doing? Don't forget, I'm doing okay today. Today, I'm bringing to you guys another video, and I really hope that you guys enjoy this particular one because this particular one I have finally brought it to home, and I really hope that you guys enjoy this video. If you are new, hi, my name is Alami Day, and I really hope you enjoy my content. I create content based on faith, on relationship, and lifestyle. So if you find yourself enjoying any of my content or enjoying all of my content, please kindly watch. Subscribe, my lawyer gang. Hi, hi to you guys. Anyways, today I'll be talking about my life experiences on Obafemi Aulawa University. And I'm not just going to be talking about... I'm not going to be talking about other people's experience. I'm just talking about my own experiences, like the things that I've seen with my own eyes and the things that I am living right now in this school, pending the fact that I have just one semester left in this school by the special grace of God. Anyways, let's get right into this video. Anyways, the reason why you can see this collarbone on my neck, or you can see that, hey, ah, why use this lane? Is this school? Is this school? You cannot pass this school. But Anyways, I'm talking about a series of things from 100 level to my final year. And the first thing I'm going to be talking about in this school is the hustle. Especially when you're just resuming over family all over university for the very first time. You're just coming to this school for the very first time. And everybody that has been in this school or that is in this school or that started with this school or just graduated from this school can actually tell you that, okay, what I'm saying is true. The first thing I'm going to be talking about is the hustle. Especially when you just resume and see, before you even enter this school, get a place to stay get a place to stay because the hustle is real i feel like things have changed now that or like then when um, when we just got in there are like 12 people in the room already and is it 12 one two three four five six yes 12 people in the room already then everybody now has a squatter that they are staying with that now makes the whole room choked so like when i first resumed like everywhere was already choked I was looking for a place to put my box. Ask me where I was putting my box under my bed. And it's that same under the bed. I'll still put my bu my bucket of water and all of those stuff. So it was crazy, you guys. So it's crazy. Like, so the hustle is real, especially when you're trying to get a hostel and school did not give you an hostel. Or like now things have changed. I heard there are like six in the room now. And even if you bring some, I don't think you can even squat, but even if you bring someone to squat with you, if you don't know what squatting is, squatting is means like you're staying with someone you are you are living with someone that that's not your space but that's where you're staying for the meantime you get so that's cutting anyways me i squatted in part one and i saw pepe the people showed me pepe in that mozambique they showed me pepe in mozambique if you don't know mozambique this is mozambique guys i didn't find the picture for mozambique i'm really sorry anyways um i used like it was choking, Sha, because we were, we were a lot in the room. Everybody in the room had a squatter. Except from, I think, just one person or two people didn't have a squatter in my room as a den and all. So, but it was choking and all of those stuff. And that also, again, when you first resume is, let's say, fetching of water. Fetching of water was crazy, guys. Ha! Can you almost stress me? Stress, I said stress. Fetching of water was crazy, you guys. From You will now walk from, like your room let's say your i think people that were at that um block her or so anyways there's this block Sha, that is down 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 i've forgotten the block where is block her or so i shall know it's far it's the last block those people are always so lucky because their toilet was tiled there was tap in their area there was well in their area so it was easy for them to fetch water i feel like the only problem they had was you know coming out of the hostel you now have to walk oh before you get to the outside of the hostel so that alone is an hustle to get water to kill for water people would have gotten there you see some people bring mountain of water I'll be like hey load day you see your ancestors that want to use it but no it's only them they say they're keeping for today tomorrow and this tomorrow all those kind of stuff yeah. so fetching of water was crazy then it was far and you know the, the queue was too much i would fetch water like that and keep it there's even a time like the one deeper life sister she had already fetch water me i was in block m she now came i cannot even laugh the room was the room was side by room she now came from like that block how far like she we, we had like five blocks or six blocks before you get to my block and she fetched water and she put it in the room in front of the room she quickly went to go and carry the third one by the time she came back my sister did not see the two bucket of water again my mama was so cool. <laughs> Jesus. She 
she cried though. She was angry. She said, and after suffering, Jesus is God. He will judge this matter. He will, I said, sister, uh, you don't know that when you fetch, they don't to fetch your anyways. Man, I already had experiences from boarding school. So it didn't really shock me. And I did pretty great too. So everything didn't really, really shock me like that. So Aside like people that were just coming into a, a boarding house setting and everything, I think they, they are the ones that suffered this thing the most because they miss smart. But while at the boarding house, because anybody to a late baby land the cap, they took bed before had the cap because of this fetching of water. And that thing again was the lecture part. God, the lecture part was crazy, running from one lecture theater to another. The one that even annoyed me the most was when we first resumed. Anyways, I did seen something like this in pre-degree, but I was hoping that, okay, maybe when we were in school, it would change better and all of that. I, first day of lecture, I went to, they said 8 a.m. Because of I already learned from PDG, I went 7 o'clock. My people asked me where I stayed. I stayed outside though. There was no space because everywhere was choked. I I now heard people had already got in there since 30 since 4 a.m. So some people, some students already prepped them that see oh, if you don't come 3 a.m., 4 a.m., you cannot get a place. And I said, okay, maybe I'll try. I'll come by six next time. I went by six next time. I still made the place full. Apparently, some people brought their pair of and toothbrush to the class to come and brush their teeth. And I'm like, on top of waiting, on top of this school too. So if you're coming to this school for the first time, prepare yourself for all those thoughts. Prepare yourself for the lecture stress and all of that. Get ready to fetch water a lot. Get ready and always have water in abundance. Get ready to run around for lectures. Like now, we can have um CHMBA, then have the next one in chem engine. So, and look at if you don't run to that chem engine, some people now, while the class was going on, they'll leave, or while the class is going on, they'll leave, they will not go to the next lecture. Their friend will be there, but they'll not go to the next lecture theater. So, that the friend will copy the remaining part of the notes, and by the time they get there, and that friend that they kept space in front, please, people can hustle in this life. I Me, mean, I didn't do all of those stuff after one week. Oh. Well, yeah, calm down. Is it that you borrow me your notes? I'll write for a bit. Don't stress me. So, all those lecture stuff, prepare yourself for it. And that thing again that I would say that happened on campus when I first got in was, you know, the stay light, the senior students asking the junior students out, the freshers out. So, them just say stay light to freshers. Stay light to senior students. Freshers are like part one students or under level students. It was loud, please. It was loud. To the extent that there's one boy, Rashid, God is looking at you. Rashid told me that... Rashid told me that he was in 600 level. He met him when I was in 100 level. My people, do you know that Rashid is still in school till now? She be Rashid that was in 600 level when I was in 100 level. Supposed to have graduated. My sister, Rashid is still in this school. I don't want to call his other name. That's why I call his Muslim name. Because if I call his other name, people will know. Hmm. Rashid is still in this school. In case he's watching my video, that's why I don't want to call him. He knows himself. You told me that when you're in other level, you met him. At that point, you're still in school with me too now. So what level are you exactly? Do you get? So you find things like that really... Ah, people can lie, Sha. You see people asking you out, telling you that they are going to marry you, they'll soon graduate. By the time you to now fresh as anyway, me, me, I didn't fall for all of those stuff because most no wala to degree. And I was me, I was doing a love love with another person like this. <laughs> now wow, well, me, I was stay faithful. Do you get I'm a faithful child? Anyways, there's a lot of stay like asking junior out, they'll go on dates, they everybody at Africa. So when you are coming to this school, just prepare your mind that you are going to get a lot of attention. And when you are getting attention, I'm sure that you are feeling like, oh, I'm the most beautiful girl on campus. Ah, it's me. I'm the hot cake. He say lie. You're not the hot cake. They want to taste you. That's all. And clean mouth. So prepare yourself for all of those stuff. And that thing, again, I'll talk about is the form part. I think the form part was so good fresh as parties fresh as week it was always nice or it was really nice then even though i didn't really participate because i already did pretty great so i was not really interested in all of those stuff i felt like i was already even having fun before any of those fun even started do you get my point i will not say more than that anyways and that thing again was the event that used to happen when they were invite um all these singers now when they were invite all this um olamide um mc mc black or something they invite a lot of people the the time that um 
Who is this this guy? Juice is one that sound Juice. YC. YC or Sosha. They invited him. In fact, that was when I, I met YC and I liked his music. I liked his person, but now I don't even listen to him anymore and all of that. But then there was always events. You buy 500 tickets. You say, guys, we need to buy you tickets. You have fun. You be on your way to the hotel like around two. You see me so I'll see you on the way. I will toast you. Like, you'll be feeling good. Like, you see one that will take you out for free. Man, I cannot even tell you of the one that they took me out to a new book with my friends and they left us there in the midnight and the jack and when rain was funny we suffered though hey so things like that is plenty like that and that one again what else and then when the exam comes i will read we'll go for overnight and all of this stuff so i just wanted to really brief you on how part one has been and all so part two is more like the is more like the um academic part plus the freedom that comes with it the freedom in the sense that you're in 200 level your parents don't care okay you stay outside of campus they only know that you're in school so you have the audacity you have the tendency to just travel to just don't travel on your own there's some people that will travel and not come back again there's some people that will travel and something else will happen there's some things that you're not supposed to be doing at the back of your parents a lot of people did that so um you have the freedom you know nobody's telling you go and wash plate you now have a place of your own and all of that so i think that was part of school then also people committing suicide then to what else i think that was just be that's just basically it then to writing of exams the academics part where lecturers are not nice where lecturers are not nice <laughs> so if you are coming to a you read though read like your life depends on it this school is not boy more other school can be had i've heard so but i don't know i don't have any, any experience with other school but with my, with my own school i have experiences read like your life depends on it but have fun so this school is fun even though it's not as fun as when i used to be in part one but it is still fun enjoy yourself be open make new friends that was the mistake i didn't make that was the mistake i made when i got into the school because i already had friends from pedigree i didn't really bother making new friends anymore and all or like people that came in as freshers they made more friends so i didn't make much friends like that now i have friends and that's because we shall met one way or the other Sha, and all of that um so one thing you should take away is like read like your life depends on it have fun enjoy yourself go out go out so that when you leave this school you will not say hey, you didn't have any fun and that thing again is this why is sports center another nice place or nice um story to tell the sports center you meet people that pray there like the when you want to have a personal retreat and all of that sports center is a good place to be it's a good place to pray it's so especially even when you want to meditate or just think there was a time that we'll go to main bowl and just lie down and be looking at the sky or white wall side yeah. i'm looking at the sky and all of that and it was so beautiful to behold you can do things like that soon and if you're coming to a uni for the first time welcome 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 even though me i may never recommend this school to anybody i'm oh, sorry and me oh, sorry I'm not going to recommend this school to anybody, but I really hope you enjoy your experiences here. And all my OE students, what's up, what's up, what's up? Hope you guys are enjoying the school. Um, how far are you willing to stay to the end? Anyways, we will not stay to the end. You shall want to finish this journey on time. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. You liked it. Please give it a like. Please share. Please comment. And if you have anything to say about the school, please let me know in the comment section. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.